After months of waiting, it's finally back. Happy Single Awareness Day! Welcome back to Chef Uack. I'm Cupid Hanzo. Can't you tell by the cosplay? Now you might be asking yourself, well, where's your wings, Cupid? Where's your date this Valentine's Day? Yeah, exactly. Don't ask stupid questions you all want answers to. But I not only want to wish you guys a happy Valentine's Day, but a happy return to Chef Uack. It's been a while, and for our special return of Chef Uack, we would be doing none other than my favorite. My favorite. <laughs> We're gonna be doing a Hanzo recipe this Valentine's Day. But not just any Hanzo recipe, a Valentine's Day special Hanzo Shimada tempura recipe. That was a mouthful. <laughs> you're gonna see why that was a mouthful. <laughs> now for tempura, you're gonna need two cups of flour, which is gonna be the only flowers you get this Valentine's Day season. <laughs> <laughs> one egg, which we're not going to be breaking that one egg because these eggs are suffering from inflation. One cup of water. Oh, my socks are all wet. Vegetable oil for frying. One small eggplant. And I kind of find it funny that Hanzo specifically called for a small eggplant. Like, what are you trying to say here, Hanzo? Huh? You hiding something? You got a small eggplant yourself. You got gnocchi mushrooms, water chestnuts, and a carrot. But who could forget the most important ingredient of tempura? Sure. Oh, God. Shrimp. Yeah, it's just kind of funny that my least favorite hero has my least favorite food of all time. Well, besides peanuts, those actually kill me. By the way, is, is water chestnuts a nut? Ingredients, water chestnuts, water, citric acid, product of China. All right, so the first thing that you're gonna be, uh, the, fir the first thing that you're gonna be doing is bringing several inches of vegetable oil to fry. Now, it, it's, <laughs> It's kind of funny. What's considered several inches? Like, like when do you think of that? That's, that's a lot. Like this. Oh, jeez, uh, we're just, look, <laughs> okay, uh, that's like about half an inch. Hey, yeah, that's good. Now, Hanzo says to bring this to 350 degrees. I don't have a thermometer, so we're just gonna do it the old-fashioned way. Now, while that's heating up, it says specifically to quickly make our batter. Well, what are you trying to say here, Hanzo? You, you quick at things? So, Hanzo says we quickly gotta do this, so we gotta unlock our inner Shimada, which is fast, quick, cringe, and three. Two, one, two cups of flour first. Oh, two cups of flour first, that's about two. And then we need an egg, and then we need one cup of water, and then we need to stir very quickly. There, there's our batter. We did it perfectly. Oh shoot, it says to stir as little as possible. We did it perfectly. Okay, so maybe I'm, I messed it up just a little bit. I might need to go a second time. Round two and three. Two, one! Very slowly, okay? We need two cups of flour. Do this nice and gently. Let us get our one egg nice and eggy. You know what sucks about that? I can't redo that take, so I'm stuck with saying eggy in this episode. And start stir- oh shoot, I forgot the water. All right, that's half a cup of water because my cup measuring spoon is dirty. I'm just gonna lightly- oh shoot, but it says to stir as little as possible. Hansel, what the- <laughs> what, do you just expect this to be the batter? I- I am so confused. And also, I just realized something. I bought mixing bowls so that I didn't have to use this anymore. Well, too Wait, I wasted $20 on Amazon. And then we're just gonna stir the batter nice and calmly and as long as I want, because you know what? I'm not gonna let some Shimada brother tell me what to do. Maybe that's why he said to stir as little as possible because now it's starting to become a dough and it's supposed to be a batter. But you know what? It is done. And my hands are really sticky. <laughs> I mean. All right, so now we're back at the oil. Now, once again, we're gonna test out if this oil is hot enough. So yeah, guys. Be sure to invest in a thermometer. <laughs> Did I forget to mention that this video is sponsored by my paint? And now that that's done and we have a very clean surface to cut our vegetables on, let's cut our vegetables, shall we? You're gonna need a cutting board that is properly sized. And of course, your properly sized eggplant. And now we're gonna reenact my last Valentine's Day with my ex-girlfriend. Now you guys know I'm the- how the fudge are you supposed to cut an eggplant? You guys know I'm the number one chef. That means my cutting skills is phenomenal. Well, there have been some, uh, people in the cooking community that has ridiculed my cutting style. Oh, really? Are you able to cut eggs faster than me when I do this? Boom! 
See? There. Perfectly cut eggplant. Now you're just gonna move that to a bowl or a clean surface like this, and you're gonna cut up more vegetables. I get- wait. Oh. It said we had to skin these. And you know, funny enough, I bought a vegetable peeler j just for these, so uh, l let's uh, yeah. Bruh. Oh, that's great. Well, it's a good thing I got a second one. You're also gonna skin that same carrot and also cube it. Now again, this isn't uh, Hanzo size. You might be saying to yourself, bro, you whack, you didn't wash the vegetables. That was intentional, I forgot. Wait, what does cube mean? Wait. Carrots are circular. They're gonna be circular, not cubicle. And oh my god, it is smoking! Oh Jesus Christ, I don't know if that's supposed to be smoking or not. It looks kind of sick though. Okay, okay, uh, we need- we need our vegetables, uh, batter. Stop, stop, I think that's 350 degrees out of- ah! That actually scared me. Okay, uh, I am freaking out. And also, on top of that, we have these cute little mushrooms. Look at that little guy! Isn't he adorable? Okay, uh, first, we're gonna- we're gonna dip. Our eggplants. How many do we do? I don't really know how to dip these, so do we just? Oh. Mm. It it did it. It did. <laughs> oh yeah, that is not sticking at all. Oh, that is awful. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, why is it so doughy? All right, there. See, now it's dipped and battered, kind of. Please get off my fingers. I don't want to be fried. Okay, you might be wondering why I'm standing so far away. I ain't getting near that. I ain't doing it. Oh God, that's burning. Uh, ah, oh. oh, that is not good. I got a vent. We're among us now, we're venting. Oh, oh yeah, that's looking nice. Oh, that's looking perfect. Let's get some uh, carrots battered up in there. Hopefully that we don't cause a fire. Oh, why are they all sticking together? My whole apartment is smoky. Yes. Yes, that's what we want right there. We want that golden brown. It would help if they were separated, but I'm, I'm happy with that. Look at that. Look, I am gonna drip everywhere. And then finally, the last vegetable, thank God, is the, 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 the mushrooms, the enoki mushrooms. I don't know the difference between enoki and regular mushrooms, but we're gonna find out right now. There you go, there, now swim, be free. All right, but that that's, that's not it. Unfortunately, I hate working with hot oil. Now we got the worst part, the shrimp. You know, Hanzo would love shrimp, and, and he, I don't need to tell you why. You already heard all the flaccid jokes. So we're just gonna dip our, uh, our baby shrimp into the baby batter. Pause. If you're wondering what my technique is, see, I'm just kind of like folding it in and Hoping that does the trick and because I'm scared putting my hand next to the oil. We're gonna do this All right, there you go now swim 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 we're just gonna get the next one ready to go. Yeah, yeah, this batter is not Sticking at all. <laughs> I'm actually kind of low-key getting the hang of this I mean, I'm having to tuck the shrimp to bed at night, but hey, it's working out just fine. Yeah, there might be a lot of a lot of gabagoo, but that's okay. Hear that clackling? That's very scary, actually. Look at all those shrimp die. You know, thinking about it, the, the batter might be done cooking. I don't know if the shrimp are though. Now that these cooled down a little bit, I mean, I'm not gonna lie. These gotta look good. Look, look at these shrimp. That's all me, baby. And there, we're finally done with this. Turn off this hot oil. I hate cooking with hot oil. Let's finally plate this up and finally just see if this is actually good or not. I'm very curious to see if this tempura or te tempura or it's it's fried shrimp, dude. Why are you calling it tempura? Aw, oh, shoot, man! I've got the water cashews! Well, guess I won't be dying today. Ladies and gentlemen, the number one chef in the online gaming community has returned with the Shimada Valentine's Day Edition Tempura, and I gotta say, like, just look at this, bro. Look at the fry job on this. Look at how good and crispy and hot and... Uh. Now, of course, every good dish needs something to wash it down with, and I decided to go with the Japanese delicacy, Dr. Pepper. Let's crack one open with the boys. And because this is Valentine's Day, and I also don't have chopsticks, we're gonna be using roses to try to eat our food with, and, and let's hope that it... <laughs> It works out. I promise I know how to use chopsticks. There we go. All right, oh, oh, I can't. Okay. All right, hot gamer boys and e girls everywhere. Here is Hanzo's tempura. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. No! This is so good! No shot! Wait, do I like shrimp? No way. 
Wait, hold on, maybe beginner's luck. Yo! I thought this was gonna be trash! This is amazing! It, it tastes just like, it tastes like a fried shrimp. That's just what it tastes like. Oh, I can't believe, hold on. And then paired with the Dr. Pepper? Th this is luxury eating! Let's try a little bit of the eggplant. <laughs> that was gross. What about the little itty bitty carrots? <laughs> that was also gross. What about the mushrooms? That doesn't taste bad. It doesn't taste like anything though. It just tastes like, like, Things. I remember when I made that Lucio soup a long time ago, it also had shrimp and I hated it, but this, this is fire! Everything was a complete disaster, except the end result. And that's why I'm the number one chef in the gaming community because even though the process was messy, the food, Guys, we're gonna be here all day sipping over Hanzo's tempura, but I want to wish all of you guys a happy early Valentine's Day or single awareness day and don't worry if you don't have a date I mean, that's mostly everybody watching this video if they're watching me <laughs> You ain't special, but at least here I can give you like a digital rose to like catch real, real quickly Did you catch it? But anyway guys, I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching again more chefy whack videos to come I know I said that last time, but I promise this time uh, just give me maybe like a couple of weeks or month. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day and bye.